Hi everyone, this is Cassandra from the Cassandra Chronicles and uh, today I'm going to do a video on uh, the real reason why I'm having gastric sleeve and uh, truth be told it is a need for me, um, not a want. So this is going to be a little bit of a, a confessional video and um, why it's kind of been the right decision for me. I'm going to do a video another day on why I chose gastric sleeve over something like um, uh, bypass or lap band, especially because I was thinking about lap band for several, several years and I had a friend who did it. Um, but uh, this is this is a video on the kind of the honest truth on why uh, I'm going to kind of gas, uh, why I'm going to drastic extremes for weight loss surgery. And so it's going to start with the honest truth. Um, I'm going to keep this short and sweet and uh, I'm going to challenge you out there who um, who are doing videos as well to do an honest truth video on um, why you think this is a need and not a want for you. So this is my truth. It started back in uh, 2012 when I tore my ACL. So let's rewind a little bit more back to 2010. Uh, I started a company and with a partner and by 2012 we decided to launch our company across the country and it was tough. Um, Sean Parker, he was one of the first kind of um, funders of Facebook and uh, he said starting a startup is like eating glass and there couldn't be anything more true to that and so um, we were working kind of 22 hour days and it was brutal and I, I took one weekend off and I went to a retreat and I did something really really stupid I tore my ACL and I uh, I tore my leg went all the way back like a flamingo went pop 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 I was rushed to the emergency and uh, the prognosis was that I completely tore my ACL I ripped my uh, MCL and I did damage to my meniscus and so uh, I was going to need surgery um, we were ugh, we were five weeks away from our launch I was put on morphine and Tylenol 3 for the remainder and I was bedridden uh, after a big launch, I went to uh, a specialist and he said, um, you're going to need surgery and um, there's a problem. And I said, what's that? And he said, the honest truth is we can't, um, we can't operate on you. You're, and he didn't say it like this, but this is what he meant, you're too fat. Um, that was the first of two wake-up calls. Um, I couldn't believe it. Uh, he said that my thighs are too wide and that uh, they can't go through the layers of fat to get to my muscle tissue. And uh, it, was, it was horrifying. Um, and so since then, um, I've been lying to people. I uh, have been saying that I've been pushing my surgery off and that uh, that um, I've rescheduled it but the God honest truth is that I can't have my surgery and for the first time um, for the first time other than my fiance and my mother I admitted it to a friend the other day because she she begged me to kind of reconsider weight loss surgery as it's really really extreme in her opinion mine too uh, and she said, you know, I'll go to the gym with you. You know, you can do this. You can you can lose weight and we'll get your ACL fixed. And I said to her, you know what? The, the honest truth is that they can't operate. I have 50 to 75 pounds to lose before, before they can do anything for me. Um, and this is where the problem starts. I need to lose weight in order to get my surgery. I need to get my surgery in order to heal and exercise. I need to exercise in order to lose weight. And I'm in a really vicious cycle. Um, and I put it off for a year. And in that year, I gained 40 pounds and lost a lot of mobility um, and a lot of physical fitness. It's hard going upstairs. I'm shaky going down hills. Um, I'm unable to do things. And um, at this point, I am I'm impaired. Um, I'm... Um, unable 
and uh, I am blocked. And so for me, my gastric sleeve is, uh, is not a want. It's not a luxury. It's um, if I want to break this vicious cycle that I'm in, it's something that I need to do for me. And so uh, this is the kind of true confession of why I'm having my gastric sleeve surgery. Um, and uh, why I've chosen to go this route. Uh, so I hope uh, you can find a, a minute of honesty in kind of what you're going through as well. I think the, the hardest part in all of this is having to be super, super honest with yourself and realizing that you're, you're an addict and that you're a flawed human being and that um, when you look in the mirror, you can see your problems. They're, they're these jiggly bits right here. Um, so that's all for now. And um, more to update later. Bye.